to an Aquarius, we're very sociable people. We can be sociable at times. Um, at times, we can be sociable. But despite us being sociable people, um, we're loners at heart. We're loners. So, um, I think we're more of being loners at heart than being sociable at heart. You know what I mean? Um, and when also also when it comes to being loners at heart, I think that when it comes to me, per se, um, I think I can get things done. Accomp- I can be. I, I think I can accomplish things better than to have a crowded full of people around me. Now, don't get me wrong. There's going to be times where I'm going to have to have people around me when it comes to certain situations or certain things that I want to do. But for the most part, um, I'd rather be alone when it comes to getting something accomplished, when it comes to a situation, when it comes to a project that I'm working on or a short film or a movie or anything that I'm trying to get accomplished. Um, 
I'd rather do it alone. For the most part. Um, but I don't like to be alone all the time. I'm just saying, you know, between being sociable and being loners, we're more loners at heart than sociable at heart. But when we are sociable, we're sociable. We can talk. And I know I can talk. <laughs> I can talk for days if I want to. I can talk all night, all day if I want to. So I love to talk. There's a lot that um, I have to say and want to say when it comes to talking on the phone or if I'm talking to someone about something important or whatever the case is. If I'm talking to someone or if I'm talking in general when it comes to a project or whatever, I like to talk. I love to talk. You know what I mean? Um, also, when it comes to an Aquarius, uh, we're very, um, we're humanitarians, which means we love to give to people. You know what I mean? Um, and then when it comes to me giving, you know, um, I love to give. I love to see the smiles on people's faces when I'm giving. You know, it's not always you have to have something in return given to you when you're giving. That's not always the case. You know, you just want to give because you just want to give. It's just it's just the person that you are. You know, it's just it's just your big heart. It's just it's just you love to give. Not always you have to have something given to you in return because you're giving. It's just something that you want to do is because of the type of person that you are. Or it is probably the type of heart that you have, which is a big heart, good heart. You know what I mean? But some people, they rather, um, they rather take than give. And I can't really stand people like that where you just want to take, take, take from someone and not give. You know what I mean? So some people in this world, they have their intentions uh, can be good, but sometimes their intentions can be bad when it comes to something that they want, you know, um, or whatever. So when it comes to people like that, that just wants to take, you know, I don't, I don't really deal with people like that. That just wants to take all the time <clears throat> and not bring anything to the table, basically. Um, but that's what I mean when it comes to being an Aquarius. We're good humanitarians. We love being humanitarians. We just love, we want to see, um, we want to see the goodness in the world. When it comes to people, um, when it comes to different atmospheres, when it comes to the neighborhoods that we live in and, and our streets and all that, and just the world in general, we just want to see peace, love, and harmony within everyone when it comes to people, when it comes to just the world that we live in itself, when it comes to uh, where we live, when it comes to our houses, our apartments, our condos, our streets, our neighborhoods, we just want to see the, the, the good. We just, we just want to see peace and love and harmony within everyone. You know what I mean? Um, and that's why I pray. I pray every day to, 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 you know, hoping for a better world to live in, a better, you know, to have just peaceful environment. You know, just when it comes to just uh, people in general, you know, I just, I just, just as Aquarius, we're just, we're just all about peace. We want peace amongst everyone, amongst the world. We're all about that. We're, we're more about love and peace and harmony. Um, also, when it comes to Aquarius, even though we can be so kind when it comes to people, but in spite of being kind, we don't like our, um, we don't like being taken advantage of or taken for granted when it comes to our kindness either. You know what I mean? Um, and even though we're good people and we're kind people, we won't take no bullshit off of people either. You know, we could be the, 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 the nicest people in the world, but we're not going to take any bullshit either. And despite us being nice, you know, there's a button that we don't want press when it comes to being an Aquarius. We kind of, we kind of leave that button hidden, you know, but it just, you know, so much a person can take when it comes to our signs. And like I said, we're just good people. We love to see love. We're all about love. We're all about peace and harmony. We're all about um, being good humanitarians and, and 
and, and, and all that good stuff, you know. But when it comes to trying, if we, if we, the thing about players is that we can, we can, we can read people like a book. We can see through people's bullshit and fakeness and deceit when it comes to just people. We can see it. We can, you know, it's like everyone has 20 20 visions. Like when it comes to an Aquarius, it, it seems like we have 40 40 vision. Like we're just from another planet. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? When it comes to being an Aquarius, we can just see, we can instantly see through people's bullshit and fakeness and people being fake and people really being genuinely happy for you. And then when it comes to an Aquarius, we can just sense the fakeness when it comes to people. Just just someone being in our presence, we can sense the bad vibes. We can sense good vibes. We can sense bad vibes. We can sense when someone's being real with us. We can sense when someone's being fake with us. It really don't make a difference. We can see right through it. You know, you can feel the fakeness when it comes to people. You can feel the realness when it comes to people. You can feel the good vibes when it comes to people. You can feel the bad vibes when it comes to people. I can feel it. And also, we have a sixth sense when it comes to people, just when it comes to just things in general. Our sixth sense is, is, is so strong. Like, really, it's very strong. And um, also... When it comes to Aquarius, I ain't saying all Aquariuses, but when it comes to me, um, um, I've always considered myself ahead of my time when it comes to being who I am and also when it comes to being an Aquarius, my zodiac sign. I've always considered myself being ahead of my time um, or whatever um, because of the way I speak, the way I see life in a more different perspective, um, the things that I like to do. And so forth. Um, just, just my personality in general. Just when it comes to my my vocabulary, you know what I mean. The words that I speak, you feel me. So, uh, Aquariuses were very, um, we're just we're, we're very uh, different. We've always considered ourselves different from all the other zodiac signs, basically. Um, there's only a, there's only uh, a few zodiac signs that we are compatible with, very compatible with. We're not compatible with all the zodiac signs and the zodiac signs, um, or whatever. But um, so Aquarius is we're just um, we're all about the radical world. You know what I mean? Um, and our planet is Uranus, and they say Uranus is a very um, strange planet, a different planet from all the other planets, you know, which is cool because for me, I like being different because it's all right to be different. It's, it's not all right to want to be like everyone else. You want to have your own style. You want to have your own vocabulary. You want to have your own um, um, perspective when it comes to looking at life in a different perspective. You want to be different. You don't want to follow the crowd. You want to be like you. You don't want to be like everybody else. And then when it comes to an Aquarius, that's how we feel. We feel like we're different from everyone else. And it's all right to be different. I love being different. And with being different, you're unique. And I think people gravitate towards my personality and who I am, the things I like to do, and just who I am as a person because I am different. People don't. You know, even, you know, people don't want to keep running into the same type of people when it comes to friendship, relationship, family, or whatever the case is, you know, there, there's somebody out there just that just wants to be in the presence of someone that's different from what they're um, not used to, you know what I mean? So it's, that's why I say it's all right to be different because different equals uniqueness. You know what I mean? So it's all right to be different. Um, so what inspired me to want to do this film is 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 is, is uh, just uh, me being an Aquarius and what an Aquarius represents and what the definition of an Aquarius is and and the traits, personality traits, and just traits in general when it comes to being an Aquarius. You know what I mean? We have our own style, the way we dress, the way we talk, the way we like doing things, the way we want to do it. It's, 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 it's our style, our way. 
my style, my way. You don't have to like it as long as I like it. And that goes for every Aquarius that's out there. Whatever you want to do in life, you do it. The way you want to do things, the way you want to do it, you do it. The way you want to dress, you dress the way you want to dress. If you want to talk a certain way, you talk a certain way. It's all about how you feel. It's all about what you want to do and how you feel. It's, you know, fuck everybody else that, that has a bad opinion on the way you like doing things in life. If you want to do it, you do it. Fuck what everybody else thinks. Everybody else is going to hate on you for whatever you do in life. I don't care who it is. It could be family. It could be friends. It could be associate. It could be a stranger. It could be somebody you're in a relationship with. But it all depends on what you think and how you feel when it comes to you, the person. You know what I mean? So, so that's all I want to say when it comes to Chronicles of an Aquarius. And I just want to say peace and love and harmony. And this is Keith Bryant, a.k.a. GP Smooth. Love is God. God is love. I feel it in the water. The stars are getting closer. Soldiers wake me in the morning. When the world is over, the lesson's getting harder. Gotta keep my focus. I'll try love a little smarter. I hate to be the martyr in the age of Aquarius.
unpredictable and so out of step But head on my time and bent on intellect uh. I'm a sucker for anything breaking the ground Turned on so much by adventurous signs This is a story of